Good morning, I'm uh, Shri Paramba with e Inc. and uh, we are at the Flat Panel Display International Show in Yokohama, Japan. And I'm going to be describing the e Inks booth that shows a number of e-paper devices. In this section of the booth, we have a number of electronic readers. This is where e Ink has been very successful in different e-reader products. I have in my hand a device made by Kobo, and you can see it's a touchscreen-based device where the reading on this particular display is. Uh, in the past, we used to say it is similar to paper. I would say it's actually better than paper at this point. Here's an example of uh, the e Ink uh, Triton display used in the Ektaco jetbook product as well as uh, there are other examples of products made by Han Wang and others. Uh, th these displays are either 9.7 inch diagonal uh, displays that are used in e-reader applications and you can see not only is the reading experience very similar to a monochrome display you also have the color feature which uh, makes for enhanced uh, um, reading as well as for textbook type applications. Here's a classroom environment where we have an e-ink display. It's one of our segmented displays that will replace the whiteboard in the classroom and the teacher can communicate with the students. In front of us there are examples of three different desks that have e-ink displays in uh, electronic textbook uh, environment where we can not only um, use the display to interact but we can also communicate with, with the teacher's whiteboard and the whole classroom en environment becomes very interactive. Here's an example of a snowboard that uses our e-ink surf display. It's a display that's cut to a unique shape, non-rectangular, and it's laminated onto a surfboard, uh, not increases in thickness at all. And our display is extremely rugged, so it can withstand a lot of um, external outdoor type uh, uh, use. We also have uh, other applications for our displays in outdoor settings. Uh, for example, the wristwatch, both on my wrist as well as uh, in the wrist of this um, uh, image that we have here. Another example of e-ink uh, electronic paper display technology used in a non-publishing application. Here's a music stand. You can imagine like it's a music textbook. Advantage with this um, uh, particular type of product is you can store your entire life's collection of music into one of these devices and it reads just like paper. You're not um, looking for your uh, scores of music. It's all right there and you can flip the pages uh, either uh, automatically or through a foot pedal. Example of e-ink Triton display used in an outdoor setting where the display um, looks extremely good in uh, bright ambient light and um, being that it's a very rugged display, we are uh, the example we're showing here is that of a GPS that is used outdoors. It's very low power, sunlight readable, and the battery will last for a very, very long time. Advantages with e-ink technology is you can increase the resolution quite a bit so the displays actually look better than paper. In this particular example, we have a 300 dots per inch display uh, using the e-ink pearl material and it's very suitable for drawings, charts, graphs and that sort of a thing. These are our uh, e-ink surf displays, they're segmented displays that are used in uh, mostly uh, indoor signage, they are used in wristwatches, smart cards and many different applications. This is a very unique technology because unlike our matrix displays, this can be cut to any shape. So pretty much where no display has gone before. Some of the examples we have here, uh, the ink and motion displays uh, that are built by our customers, motion display and Neolux, they are used in indoor signs where we have the display pretty much laminated against a color overlay and gives you the perception of motion and it attracts a retail shopper uh, down to your aisle where you've got these kind of displays. I'll show you a few more examples. We've got the Samsung's Alias 2 cell phone with a changeable keypad that is an e-ink display that will allow you to change the keypad depending on the application what you're doing. Here's another example of a surf display in comparison to an LCD. On my right is the LCD monochrome uh, display and then there's the e-ink display. In high ambient applications like an outdoor GPS type setting, you can see there is almost like a day and night difference.